Okay. Let's see what are the accounting entries which are passed if you issue the debentures at a premium and you redeem them at par. XYZ Limited issued 20,000 debentures of 100 each at a premium of 10%. Again, the standard practice. What is the face value? The face value is 100. Right? The premium is equal to 10% or rupees 10. Right? Hence the cash received on issue of these debentures is 100 plus 10 or 110. Right? And what is the redemption price? Such debentures can be redeemed at par. So the redemption price is equal to 100. Right? So for 20,000 debentures, what will be the total face value that you receive? You will get 20, 100,000. What is the total premium? 20,000 into 10 or 200,000. The total cash received obviously is the sum of these two. So you get 2200,000. And the redemption price is 20,000 into 100 or 200,000. Right? So effectively you received 2200,000. You need to pay 200,000. So there is an inherent gain as I may call it that is there which is 2200 minus 2000 which is 200,000. Normally these type of cases are rare. Okay. Because no one is going to give you money to keep it. And this is effectively that. Right. So let's see what are the accounting entries. Right. So basically when you get this 20, 100,000, what you will do? You will debit your bank account by how much? Debit. How much is the money you've received? You received 2,200,000. So you put in 2,200,000 to debenture application account. Right? Now this 2,200,000 is on a what account? One it is 20 lakh to the extent of issue of debentures and 200,000 because of the security premium or the premium that you receive. So you will transfer this debenture application account by debiting it by equal amount, right? And credit it to one face value of debentures to debenture account 200,000 because that's the amount of liability that you have to pay. Right? And what is the balance? The balance is the premium that you have received. So what is the premium account where it goes? It goes to the security premium account. 200,000. Right? Right? 